So Burst of Spectres in the Russia is not the most profitable spawn, but with double EXP and double loot, this place is going to be awesome. I used my 370 EK here, and I also done some team hunting with my druid here, and the EXP is pretty fine. Hunting here on my EK, I barely break even at this spawn during normal hunting soul, but during the double loot event, I will be making some decent profit here. And the EXP is to be expected around 8 to 9kk per hour, which is amazing. The damage you deal here is fire, so bring fire weapons as a knight or great fireballs as mages. As a knight, you will want to have ice protection and life drain protection. Glacial amulets are awesome here. The damage that this monster deals is mostly ice damage, as you can see in the hunt analyzer. As life drain protection I use a bone fiddle. Spawns that have only one monster are the best to put praise on. You will gain so much from that, and considering you kill 400 burst respecters per hour, you will get a lot more EXP if you manage to get EXP prey active. Killing 400 burst respecters in one hour means that you will have around 6 hours here to finish the beast area, which is totally fine. The analyzers come from my elite knight. As you can see here, I barely break even on a normal hunt. I expect the loot to be around 800k per hour during this event. What spawns are you going to try out during the double loot, double EXP? Tell me down in the comments. One of the best things about this spawn is that it's a big circle to run around in. That means the hunt gets a good, good flow and you can really, really feel like you're maximizing the EXP per hour here. So to get access to this place, you need to have done a short prequest in the TBN desert. I will put a link to that in the description, so check it out and do it whenever you can. If you want to see more helpful guides and tips in the future, considering subscribing to the channel, I would love to have you as a part of my community. And I got several more double EXP, double loot event guides coming up in the future. If you like statistics, check this night hunt guide out, where I kill 650 hydras and collect Oromon points at the same time. Until next time, see ya.